Hello everyone and welcome back to Final Fantasy 7. So today we're going to continue playing. Um, Tifa wanted to stop here at this um, place. I don't know why. When I got hurt back in Nibelheim, they brought me to this clinic. The doctor oh. here, Shirin, he's the one who saved my life. Oh. They brought You're her here. Me, Interesting. Doc Shirin's the one who fixed you up. Come on. So, Sheeran, I don't rem remember that name for the original, so I don't know who it is. And it's so dark in here, I can't see from out here, so... <laughs> they, don't, they don't want to spoil it or anything. Uh-oh. Do not be deceived. Uh-oh. You know the truth. Trust in me. It's probably a Sephiroth clone. <laughs> Now you think he would learn by now to stop attacking Sephiroth whenever he sees him, because this is like the fifteenth time now it wasn't Sephiroth. <laughs> so what are they doing here? The hell's gotten into you, man. What's going on? <laughs> Barrett Wallace. Doctor Sheeran. It's it's been a while. <laughs> Certainly has. <laughs> That's one frightening looking appendage you got there. But hey, at least you still seem to have your help. So I'm guessing he's not the one who gave him that one? Oh, I'm feeling the miles, but the work keeps me trucking. Also, is this supposed to be so the Madeo doctor? Do you remember me? Well, of course I do, Tifa. But it hasn't been that long. You heal up all right? I did, yeah. I just wanted to drop by and say thank you. If it wasn't for you, I doubt I'd be standing here today. Don't thank me. Thank Lady Luck and Shinra for that helicopter. Hmm? I'm sorry, Shinra? I know you might find it hard to believe, but not all the apples in that bunch are rotten. But seriously, you're living proof of the good in people. Don't ever forget that. It'd be a pity to let their kindness go to waste. Yeah. So I wonder who Besides, you helped need to her then. a good example for your friends here. Oh, right. Well, I got gotcha. you. Mind helping me out? Need to draw that gentleman's blood. You think you can hold him still for me? At first, I thought it was just Mako poisoning. It is until I ran some tests. The results were strange. Uh oh, gotta be careful! Don't extract strange Genova now. cells from them. That could the be dangerous. Turned up. One I've never seen before. Not sure what to make of it yet, but it did remind me of one I have seen. Your eyes, soldier, right? X soldier. It's not a job, son. Once a soldier. Always a soldier. Huh. Spare a drop? No. <laughs> I ask because I suspect there's soldiers suffering from cellular degradation. Ooh. Just a theory for now. And one I can't prove, not without a lot more testing. You've seen many of these guys come through? Yeah, and then some. I do what I can for the injured ones, but leave the rest to stumble onto the saucer. Why would they go there? I mean, can't go gold saucer. I'm so excited. Don't ask me. I think it's odd too. So, cellular degradation. That was something that was happening to Genesis and Angeal in Crisis Core. But, I don't think that happens to any of the other soldiers. I think it's just those two because they were kind of like, um, a test to see if they could make another stuff off, but they failed. Ain't that something? The girl I saved coming back here with Barrett of all people. I'm sure there's some kind of cosmic significance to that, <laughs> but hell if I know what it is. <laughs> oh, you're not wrong. <laughs> Boss, is he the medieval doctor? Because he does kind of look like him. But I don't know why he would be here. I don't know. I guess we'll have to see once we get there if the medieval doctor is him. But I don't know. Very strange. That is cool that he saved Tifa's life. Doc mentioned the gold saucer, right? As in the amusement park, where every day is a holiday. We're going, right? I mean, we have to. Yuffie, 
This isn't a vacation. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Weird mumbling guys, got it. Oh man, this is gonna be so much fun! Tom's got a ropeway that'll take us straight there. It's not far. If we're doing this, let's just do it. So, I'm guessing that's it. Fast travels available, new quest. Um, oh, you have a quest. What is it? If it's some, like, fetch quest, then I'm just not going to go do it. Glad you're here in any case. I got a situation. See for yourself. If it's a hunter monster, then. If you want him back, what the heck? One million gil. <laughs> Agree to the terms, and we'll take care of the rest. What's this? Beats the hell out of me. Guess some fool got it in their head I was making money off my research. You gonna pay up? Look at this place. I can barely afford bandages, never mind a ransom. <laughs> also, <laughs> only option we don't care about the road people. <laughs> or hire the right merc to save him for me. Or the right merc's friend, to be more precise. Right. Who better to hunt down a criminal than someone who's got a nose for tracking? One finer than any human could ever possess. Well, I can't argue with you there. That was easy. <laughs> so where do we start? Um... The victim, I guess? Curious about the guy who got nabbed? Well, what is there to say? I mean, their most notable traits ain't exactly unique. What number did he have? <laughs> I can give you a name or next to kin, neither. Could try to question the others, but we both know how that'd go. Cloud, the letter, if you don't mind. Oh yeah, I'm sniffing the letter. It's like a bloodhound. There's a strong scent, but cologne, perhaps? The heck? How about that? Picked up the trail already. Oh, which reminds me. There's a compound in our rogue friend's sweat that glows when exposed to this light. Just hope it helps some. What? In the world? <laughs> okay. Um, I guess Follow it... Me, Cloud. I mean, if it's if like in this town, then I'm sure it won't take that long. Sense is 7, times more sensitive than yours. That's very all specific. <laughs> are as distinct as any perfume. A single sniff of a person's clothing is enough for me to locate them. Though there are a number of competing smells through which I must sift. Huh. What do I smell like? <laughs> hmm. Like a man who's killed his fair share of fiends, I suppose. Like blood and shit. Not literal shit. Okay. <laughs> That's funny. Um, I guess we're doing this. Sure. I'm sure it won't take that long. Who the heck? Went in Cologne and captured a one of those guys. Also, what is that? An enemy. What is this? Ow! Okay. That wasn't cool. It's a land one. Um, let's cure a cloud. Oh, I just barely dodged that. Um, let's assess you. You are weak to ice. Yuffie's in our party, right? Yeah. Okay. Yo, crazy music. Okay. Um, let's get ice up in here. Do some ice damage. This a strong. Uh oh, what is he doing? Oh, dear. Oh, it's trying to swallow Yuffie. No, stop it. Don't do that. It's not cool. Nice. Okay. Do that. Um, okay, it's dead. <laughs> nice. Alright, uh, I can't move. Hello? Okay. I'm guessing it was pointing me towards red, but just let me move. <laughs> I don't know why it wasn't letting me move. That was weird. This is a cool area. It's next to, um... Actually, I wonder where this is exactly then, because this is Corel. So, Gold Saucer would be over here, so that would mean this... Would that be towards Gungaga, or...? Closer to Souls over there... Um, I don't know, I'm trying to like think about the original map and where that would lead. Also, oh, is a Chimera, okay. Hold on. Um, that's scary. So these guys actually give a pretty good, um, 
Oh, there's another thing, I think. Yeah, a sand spitter. So you're weak to fire. Ow. Where's the other thing? Ow, stop it. I want to attack the other thing. Okay, um, assess the sand spitter. Um, also weak to... Um, fire. Can this Chimera stop attacking me? Um, okay. Triple slash. Please kill that Chimera. Ow! Oh, it's pressure. I don't know how, but I'm not going to question it. Um, focus thrust. Uh, let's do fire. Come on. Nice. Aerith, use, um, you don't have any fire, but whatever. Just use whatever. There we go. Okay, but uh, those guys give you, I believe, Aqua Breath in the original, which is a really good enemy skill. Um, that's the one that the second Genova fight gives you in the original. And, yeah, that's... What? Nothing. Let's continue. What? A fire? Oh. No. Hello there. <laughs> there was he smelling the fire? He has nothing to do with the kidnapping. <laughs> yeah, he's just smelling the meat. Oh, you must be hungry, huh? <laughs> he's acting like a Sorry, dog. But this is people food. <laughs> Red. Whoa, easy there. I can spare a bite. <laughs> Red was just hungry. <laughs> That's all it was. Well, did you need to do that? <laughs> what the? What was that noise? Hmm. <laughs> now that you mention it, it was his one hooded fella. The chocobo carriage headed toward a cave nearby. Interesting. Um. <laughs> So goofy. What was the saying? Oh yeah, Aqua Breath is a super strong water move in the original that you get from the oh, Genova life. I have one terrible weakness. <laughs> Food. My appetite. <laughs> With this overpowering aroma of meat in the air, I don't think I'll be able to focus on the kidnapper's scent. Uh, oh well, it looks like it's I right there. That. So, Real I guess. Is all it takes to throw you off your game. What was that? I think we found the guy. He was literally just right there. So um, it wasn't very hard. You gotta be close. Time to put the doctor's light to use. Light? Oh, UVA light. Ooh. Okay. What in the world? So it's walking over here. So they leave a. Uh, Purple glowing thing when they walk. Um, yeah, that's Genova cells. That's <laughs> uh, definitely not normal. Ooh, there's a chest, purple chest over there. Okay, hold on. let me fight. Bring it. Can I attack these guys? Oh, I have even. Wait, I thought I scanned them. Ooh, nice. Oh, they let themselves out. I thought I assess these guys. Whatever. Okay. Nice. Come on, mess him up. Oh, nice to have the guy just ran right into me. And these guys are very easy, so I'm not worried at all. Um, give me this chest. I wonder what weapon's going to be. Um, Amethyst Collar. Ooh, what that's for Red. I know he's not in my party, but might as well see. Actually, did he have a... Oh, he hasn't run this yet. So... Supernal Fervor. Oh, grants haste to on all party members. That's really good. But it can only be used during Vengeance Mode. Does it get rid of Vengeance Mode like um, Crescent Claw? Hmm, I don't know. But we'll just continue on since we don't really need to equip that right now. Um, okay, I was trying to run, but I guess that works too. Dodging. This music was in Remake, I believe. I forget where. 
Well, Sheeran asked us to rescue his patient. He didn't say anything about how we should deal with the kidnapper. You mean? We'll figure it out later. It depends on how aggressive he is. So he, the other guy went that way, but there's goodies over here. Give me that. Torma line and two handfuls of gold dust. Neat. Um, I don't know how big this area is. Just give me all of that. Um, anything over here? I know the I was supposed to go to the right, but um, I want to see what's over here. Um, just like a grenade. That's neat. Another grenade. It's gotta be a chest over here. It's like a secret path. Yep, I, I told you there was a chest. This is why you listen to me. Two thousand gil. Wow, it's pretty good. Um, or is a chimera? Is that two chimeras? I think yeah, it's two chimeras. Um, okay. Ooh, you be get away. Um, fire. Um, this is a bit dangerous because there's a lot of stuff going on and everyone's taking a lot of damage. Um, oh dear, Cloud's about to die. Ow. Stop. It's hurting me. <laughs> Come on. Kill it. Um, let's do that. Oh, it's almost dead. Okay. There it is. Oh, get away. Um, let's do this. Okay. Hopefully that works against him. Um, let's just do focus first. Ow. Jeez, that hurts. A lot. And that comes out very fast. Come on, he's almost staggered. Nice. Just kill him. Nice. Easy peasy. Okay, so... Wait, what? Wait, so is this where we came from? Because it looked like we needed to go the other way. Or is this the other path that I didn't go? Yeah, it looks like it is. So we took the long route, but it looks like it goes over to where I was. I don't know how, because I didn't see any tracks. Yeah, it goes over here. Oh, wait, I came from up there. I didn't go this way. Okay. I thought somehow I missed the, um... What was the guy doing putting his hands on the wall like that? <laughs> Is he climbing on the walls or something? Um... I thought I just somehow missed those tracks when I was walking over to the chimeras. Hey, this is actually a big area. What the heck are we? Um... Looks like there's a bunch of, like, parkour we gotta do. It's not expecting this area to be this big, jeez. Okay, well... That's fine. Uh, what do you mean, we're fine here? Come on, attack the thing. Just keep attacking and then eventually it'll pop out. Ow! Come on, you guys have gotta attack it. I can't, like, lock onto anything. It's just like, come on, now, oh, man. <laughs> this thing's so annoying. It just stays on the ground. Attacking them. Okay, so yeah, we just gotta wait to, for them to attack. Nice. Okay, just kill it, please. There we go. It's just annoying. They waste time. Um. Whoa. That's weird, my TV froze, but my monitor did not. Oh, okay. <gasps> That's cool. <laughs> okay, technical difficulties are solved. <laughs> I don't know what happened, my TV just froze, and then my recording stopped, so that's cool. <laughs> It's weird, it's usually the monitor that stops recording, or not recording, but freezes and acts all weird. But this time it was my TV. Pull the Uno reverse card on me. <laughs> it's not cool, man. Just work. Why does everything not want to work? <laughs> um. Oh, what is that over there? 
I don't know, there's things hanging over there. Um, I don't know where we're going. This is like a very large area. Oh, wow, it's one of those guys. Death Claw. This guy's also had um uh a thing in Majig in the original. Oop, I did not mean. Oh wow, he did a lot, a lot of damage. Okay, I'm not weak to anything. That's cool. Okay, um, I need to cure myself because I'm about to die. Um, but yeah, those guys I believe have laser, which is a um attack that does percent damage, which can be kind of meh in the original because most enemies tend to resist um percent damage. Oh, nice. Oh, I thought that other guy died. Uh oh, Ooh, that was close. I feel like that's probably like an instant kill move or something. Oh, steel material went up. Neat. Even though I'm not really using steel, probably should, but it's like, meh. I feel like you can't really get anything too good from stealing. I'm sure there is probably like really good stuff you can't get from stealing, but I'm just lazy. Okay, shut up. <laughs> um. So it's over there we need to go. I'm guessing we need to open that door, maybe? Is there anything else around here? Doesn't really look like it. We can drop down here. Give me that stuff. Maybe we can jump up here. More boxes. Break all the boxes. Oh, and this is over here, yeah. Okay, so I guess we should just go towards that door. See what's over here. Yeah, the footprints are over here still. Um, I imagine I'm not going to be able to just open the door. Yeah, it's locked. Look for a way to open the door. But the footprints go over here, which is interesting. Very weird. Where is this guy going? Oh, there's another death ball. Get out of here. Um, I guess you can just do like um Sonic Boom, sure. Um, you don't have cure, do you? No, you do not. Oh well. Do that. Nice. Cloud's just messing them up. Um, let's clear Cloud because he's about to die. Nice. Um, okay, so where are we going? Up here, I'm guessing? Oh, wait, there's a thing in my jig. And another item. Some golden items down there. Is this going to be the lever to, um, open the door? Oh, no. Make your way across. There's no way this guy did this, the Sephiroth clone dude. How in the world would he have done this? Okay, so I don't know where I'm going. Uh. Oh, okay, I see. Are they gonna come from over there? Out? Where's happening? Go over there. <laughs> I don't know where I'm trying to go. Um. Over there, maybe. Let me. No, I can't go over there. Come on. Let me go over there quickly. Yeah, I made it. So do we just jump down here? Yes, we do. Okay, there's a store here. I can buy a mega potion. Thank you very much. And then I'm guessing we're just supposed to. How do you all get over here? <laughs> go over here, maybe. Do I see? Oh, look, some. Somehow, this Sephiroth clone dude actually did all that. I don't know how. What? Oh, we go over here. I was confused. It's just pointing at the wall. So I'm guessing there's something we gotta activate over here. And then... Go open the door, maybe? Yeah, it did. I have a feeling this isn't gonna be very easy. Did he, like... How'd he climb... 
How do you do that? This guy's crazy. So there was a thing over here I want to go check out over here because I'm sure it's like a chest or something I missed. Over here. Let's see. Yeah, see. I knew there would be a chest. Ooh, and some goodies as well. Ooh, and an elixir. It's actually pretty good. <laughs> Alright, so what's in here? Is there going to be some kind of monster? It's look oh, it's a big area. How do you guys get... Freaking teleporting around here. There's a lot of boxes as well. The heck? This is the kidnapper's camp. No sign of them. So, do we wait? Help! Some crazy bastard kidnapped us and stuck us in this cave! <laughs> <laughs> the song. Question them. Yeah, this is... Would we know anything? We were too freaked out to even look at him. <laughs> the kidnapper could be anywhere or anyone. You're just selling yourselves out, then. Cloud, <laughs> it's them. Yeah, I already knew it. Oh, boo! <laughs> Are we going to fight them? Aren't you a clever little puppy? Sniffing out. Right to have guns, okay. That's a little concerning. But what? I think we just tell you? We're not your average criminals, kid. In fact, we're the world's greatest double act. Ellie? Sure. <laughs> Bury the brash. Bury the brash. What kind of name is that? Oh. They apparently tamed monsters? That's. <laughs> sure. I wonder what your friends would have paid for you. Guess we'll never know. Okay, well, they're just leaving. Oh boy. Dark Claw. Uh oh. Nice. Um, let's assess this guy. So he's like a special Death Claw. We'll pressure it. No weaknesses. Okay, ow. Ow. Um, Aerith, can you please hurry up and get a thing? Uh oh. Ow. Dang it, I was trying to do my thing. Get away. Um. Oh, bother. This is not good. Um, I don't know. Just keep doing stuff. Ow. Yuffie. This is not good. <laughs> Everyone's very low. Um. Aerith, please get haste. I need you to hurry up. Okay, um, Kira on Aerith, because she's about to die. Oh, oh man, she oh, it went away very... Ah, I can't talk. Oh, great, Yuffie's dead. Okay, Cloud, use a Phoenix down. Oh, this is very bad. <laughs> what happened to my thingy magic? Come on. Um... Let's just do this, sure. Ah, oh, really? I was hoping... I even know he suddenly targeted onto me. That's not cool. Uh oh. Get... Run away! Nice. Okay, so yeah, he goes very far with that. Um, Phoenix down, Aerith. Come on, I would like to pressure him. Uh oh. Come on, nice. Okay, um, I guess we should use Braver. Okay, um, let's just do our limit. I don't know my controls, though. And then synergy ability, firewood blade. Go, kill it. Um, okay, we need a. Is Aerith? No, Aerith still is in chase. Kill it, please. Yeah, we. Oh, we did we kill it? Yeah, we killed it. Nice. So now we're going to kill them.
What? <laughs> he found his way over here. Hey, we told you to stay put. I think it's going to listen to you. Tied him up. Uh oh. Oh, he's pointing at Cloud. Old buddy of yours? Barry, look. The kid's eyes. He's a soldier. No wonder he wiped the floor with that monster. But time ain't on his side. Even the strongest ones don't stay strong for long. Sooner or later, he'll wind up like all the rest. Another mumbling hooded freak. <sighs> stay a while! Sure you got lots to catch up on! Suck it, losers! Bro, shouldn't we? Ah. Let him go. We got our man. <sighs> I'm with Red. Freaking chase after them. Bite their ankles. Let's take him back. Chew him off. <laughs> Glad to see our man still alive. Red warrior. Ooh, got a thing for, for a Red. Few scrapes, none the worse for the wear. <sighs> Is it true that soldiers' cells degrade? Uh, believe me, if I knew, I'd tell you. But Shinra keeps a tight lid on everything soldier-related. Only doctors with access to those secrets are the company's own. I certainly don't qualify. If anyone here was going to have answers, it'd be you, son. Been feeling under the weather? Not really. The procedure you boys underwent was cutting edge. So much so, I doubt anyone in the company knew what the long-term effects might be. The more information we have, the better. <laughs> so, uh, change your mind about that blood sample? No. <laughs> <laughs> well, one of these days, I'll win you over. Hmm. Ooh. Relationship with Red has changed. Nice. I did it. Okay, now let's go with Gold Saucer, because I really want to go with Gold Saucer. Um, oh man, we're going to see Kate Sith. I'm excited to see Kate Sith. I, a lot of people don't like him, but Ready? I'm just excited to see how they're going to do him in this game. Um, oh. oh yeah, let's just go. I don't think there's much to do here. At least I hope I don't miss anything. This will take us all the way to the salsa. Hey, you can't let those assholes talk to you like that. We should go back and uh, beat him up or something. <laughs> Practically, the whole damn town came out to crap on him. Someone tell me why I'm the only one who's pissed here. I told you, I can take it. Think you could at least tell us what it was all about? They were talking like you sold them out for money, but I know that isn't true. That's not you. So how'd they get it so wrong? Where the hell is it? This about her? About Marlene? Much decent place with decent coal. Oh man, the music. Decent folks too. Rough around the edges, but big hearts. Salt of the earth. And I sold them all down the river. Took away their future and their hope. Oh, again, the we flashback. Were happy. Covered in soot and porous dirt. But none of that mattered. We had friends and family. And that was enough. Till we learned about the miracle of Mako and all we'd been missing out on. And then we just had to have a taste. <laughs> so now only dying is opposed. Damn right I am. We can't just also abandon the mines. Not after our fathers and grandfathers risked their lives to maintain them. I hear you, Dine. I do. But nobody sees any future in coal. So I ask you, 
Why break our backs working harder and harder when we're taking home less year after year? <sighs> if I may, sir. Once the reactor is complete, a portion of the revenue will go to the town. Your community will be preserved, or enriched, I should say. Listen, man. This is your chance to give your daughter a better life than what we have. You think I haven't thought about that? Come on. Are we gonna let some city slickers tell us our coal is worthless? We gonna let them tell us we're worthless? It would seem we've reached an impasse. In which case, any further discussion would be a waste of breath. So, Mr. Mayor, shall we put it to a vote? Also, it's funny that they all blame Barrett, but, um, they all also agreed with him, so it's not like it was completely his fault. Everyone was ecstatic, convinced it was the dawn of a new era. Then one day... The reactor exploded. <laughs> Y'all saw the aftermath. And then, Shinra came rolling into town. Burned everything. Innocent people in their homes. Was that Scarlet? It was, wasn't it? Yeah. That bitch. <laughs> That's the only word to describe her. I don't get it. <laughs> Why burn the whole town? To craft a story that it was all the work of a local insurgent group. But ain't no villager ever gone near the reactor. They lie right through their teeth. Usually don't we get that story till the prison in Gold Saucer? I think that's where he tells it. Maybe. I'm not sure. But I guess it makes sense to move it here as well. Speaking of the prison, I'm really interested in how that's all gonna happen and work. Is this really how it's gonna be? Listen, I don't want your sympathy or your pity. You can keep all of that nonsense. I did what I did, and I can live with it. Right. We gotta shake this off. We're about to rock up to the funnest place ever. The Gold Saucer. Huh? So turn those browns upside down. <laughs> what in the hell? Ain't no one but you thinking about how much fun we're gonna have. Right? Wanna have a look? It's coming up over there. Red <laughs> <laughs> the Tink's excited too. To see we're all on the same page. <laughs> all that glitters is not gold. <laughs> 
Oh boy. <laughs> Here we go. What is that? It's Ifrit and Shiva, what the heck? Why are they here? <laughs> it was bad bad to shoot them. No, the like um This is incredible. What is it called? Holograms? Yeah. The chocobos! Multiple colored chocobos. The heck is that? <laughs> this is insane. <laughs> I'm so excited. I'm mostly just excited to see Kate Surf. I'm interested in how they're gonna do him. Here we are, the gold saucer. Oh man, I hope I have the money to buy a ticket for entry because if I remember, it's very expensive in the original. But, um, I don't know how much money I have. Fast travel is unavailable. Oh look, you're here. What are you doing here? <laughs> Probably gonna be all weird. No one's gonna like you. Freaking weirdos. Staff room. Can we? Ooh, there's a material in here. Hey, what are you doing here? You're not a staff member. I know for a fact that you are not a staff. Ooh, a healing material. Okay, bye. <laughs> um. Okay, so we're going over here. Also the music, of course. Classic gold saucer music. Um Coel region, skies above. What the heck? Barrett Wallace. What's Palmer doing there? And Cloud Strife. Just pulse three? Look at them. Look. <laughs> Waltzing around with the flower seller and Hojo's lab rat. Who are these people? At least they're finally on a real wanted list. It's about time. That's all well and good. But why am I in charge of handing out the posters? <laughs> Don't they know I have a division to run? I think you're where the president wants you. Alright, that was random. Is some with Palmer going to happen here or something? Because Cloud, the others are waiting. Actually, they did say they want him hand to mouth, so yeah, they might come here. That's not good. <laughs> so that's not the helicopter they were on. That's for a fact. Um, buggy parking. We can park a buggy here. The heck? Oh yeah, we're gonna get the buggy. Is that the buggy we're gonna get? Oh, I forgot about the buggy. <laughs> oh, I'm excited to get the buggy. Although that's probably not gonna be. What? That the sounds terrified me. Okay. <laughs> but um, yeah, that's not gonna happen till way later once we're done with this place. What is happening? There's a Kate Sif statue. My goodness, it's Kate Seth! Oh, he's right there. Alright, everyone, let's get this party started! <laughs> this voice, why is this music? The cacton! And Tom Barry. Fat Chocobo! <laughs> the heck? What? How did he just do that? What is happening? What in the world? What is happening? <laughs> uh, okay. Red <laughs> is on freaking Barrett's back. Oh, it's this guy. Of course, he's here. What is, are they having a dance battle? What is happening? I, I think they're having a dance battle. What is happening? Uh, 
That was so random. <laughs> Oh, it's freaking what's his name? Uh, what is happening? <laughs> what? Dude's freaking ripped. <laughs> what? <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I am scared. <laughs> what? Yuffie's dead. <laughs> he just killed Yuffie by flexing. Oh no. Hold on, you're telling me. Okay, it's three of those guys. I thought it was just one skinny guy that was carrying him. What the heck, bro? Oh, what's happening? Not a dance battle, right? Surely he wants an actual fight. Welcome to our gilded paradise, <laughs> the gold saucer. Oh my god. Dio, Dio, that's his name. And you, sir, are Cloud. <sighs> well, Cloud, shall we do To the death? Let's go. Now, now, when fate sets us a challenge, we must rise to meet it. Are you ready to rumble? <laughs> what is happening? Are we just going to fight? What was going on? You can do this, Cloud. <laughs> what is... I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> oh, my. What? Oh, my. <laughs> what is happening? What? Are we having a dance battle? I'm so confused. What is happening? Fight! I don't know what's happening. <laughs> oh, nice fourth wall break. Right hook with R2. Oh my goodness, it's the... Oh. What in... <laughs> so... Okay, so left hook, right hook... Oh, uh, I hit the wrong button. <laughs> I thought it was left, not right. So... Okay, so it's the freaking boxing mini game from the original. I block somehow. Okay. This is great. Okay, and two hits in a row. So what do I do? <laughs> so the music. Oh, oh man. I didn't know he was going to do that. I thought it was just... Alright, so is he going to attack now? Alright, so now he's probably going to do something. Yeah. This music is great. I also love that they're using the original models. I guess he's not really using the original models, but... Well, not for Dio, but Cloud anyways. But, um, Dio's model is different. Oh man, I hit the wrong button. I hit the... What? I hit... Okay, whatever. That's fine. Okay. Oh, I hit the... I try to go left, not right. Oh, I hit the... Ah! <laughs> I'm doing terrible. Let me break. Mess him up. I, he did cross slash with his fist. Heck yeah. <laughs> yeah, Dio's model isn't quite the like the original for Klaus is. <laughs> Red 13, alright. I mean, okay. Sure. Well fought, young man. <laughs> Let 
Let's give our worthy contender another thunderous round of applause. <laughs> Even Cloud's excited. <laughs> that was weird. <laughs> well, thanks. <laughs> that was a cactus. Token of my thanks. One golden ticket. Your ticket oh. to paradise. Golden passports. <laughs> cool. <laughs> cool. Let's go. So we just he just gives us the golden ticket instead of um we are we happy to buy it? Okay. Well, that's cool. Nicely done. Pretty nervous. Oh, this <laughs> okay, used to performing in front of crowds. You should have seen him in <laughs> oh no. Where'd Kate Seth go? We didn't want to see him. But um, there's something that's great about Kate Seth is his freaking Scottish accent. Haunted Hotel. <laughs> the Haunted Hotel is going to be fun. <laughs> Didn't grab Red's hand. I mean, you only have two hands, so I don't know how you would have, but still. Get some sleep, okay? I want to explore too. <laughs> mm, oh wait, does that mean we're going to get Kate Sif because it's only two of us? We might get Kate Sif because uh, there's only two of us and he would make a third party member. Wait, is that- oh no. I thought that was him for a second, it's just a little statue. Well, um, I'm gonna end this video here. We're in Gold Saucer. I'm so excited here to be here. Very cool to see Kate Sif and Dio. And that was also a very insane, like, intro to Gold Saucer. Also, this place looks crazy, dude. Like, it's massive. Holy cow, dude. So those are the helicopter pads. Oh man. Oh, wait, what's happening? I didn't mean to go out that far. I, I don't know what's happening. Okay, whatever. <laughs> but um, as I was saying about Kate Sif, I'm... I can't... I still, like, can't get over his Scottish accent because, like... When I first saw him, never did I think he would have a... freaking Scottish accent. Like, that's so out of nowhere, I feel like. But, um... Yeah, I am excited to get him, especially in combat. I'm very excited to see how he's going to be in combat because I'm very interested to see what are they going to do with him. He's such an interesting character in the original, so it's like, how are they going to make his combat in this game? Very interested, but we're going to have to find that out next time. So for now, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.